My name is Larry Kirshner. I'm the president of a company called Blacklight Attractions. Our company has built some of the coolest attractions across the world. We built a haunted mansion dark ride in China. We built an attraction inside the old London Bridge. We did a James Bond attraction for MGM Studios, Six Flags, Paramount Parks, Universal Studios, Cedar Point, Kennywood. We built a Spider-Man dark ride. That's where people sit in a car and they shoot guns and they score points. We also did an incredible hawk, a Blacklight Mini Golf, which was probably the most technologically advanced mini golf ever built. We even did an attraction in Tombstone, Arizona, believe it or not, but we never know what we're gonna build. We actually got a call to do a Blacklight Mini Golf Aquarium that had shark tanks and more eight heels. We gave uh, Larry this site where uh, a tired dark ride was and uh, he's brought it back to life. We also did an entire zoo, kind of indoor zoo with crazy alligators, reptiles, sharks, you name it. We do interactive animatronics, haunted houses, escape games, laser tags, mini golf, sophisticated interactive shooting dark rides, aquariums, theming, zoos, we've done all sorts of kinds of stuff. We're based here in St. Louis, Missouri. We do the design work, we do drawings, all the fabrication, it doesn't matter where in the world it is. We ship it to them, then we show up on their location, and then we have a very, very tight deadline, and the pressure is immense. It could be a nightmare on this. Government is closed. Okay, I guess I have no talent. If that wasn't enough stress, we also run one of the world's biggest haunted houses called The Darkness. People refer to it as the best haunted house in America because it's the most technologically advanced haunted house in the industry. The haunted house industry regards it literally as the highest level quality. And it's all definitely American attractions. Our shop here in St. Louis is about 50,000 square feet. We use all kinds of different equipment. We have vacuum core machines, hard coating guns, gunite machines. We carve foam every kind of carpentry thing you can think of. People who are graphic designers. We have a green screen room because a lot of our clients need custom pre-shows, special effects, CGI, so we actually film them. Now we're done to listen to Larry talk. Hey, Larry ain't a carpenter, he ain't a sculptor, he ain't a lighting technician, he ain't none of that, okay? If you ask my workers what I do, they would say nothing. I do do a lot, I deal with all the clients. They, sometimes they stress me out just as much as the workers. We got an army of people working here. There's a lot of interesting characters that work here. There's Jim, who's very technical minded. He basically manages everything that goes on in the shop. Hi, my name is Jim Kelly, and I run this shop. The only way I can actually explain it is organized chaos. There's Mike Zablonski, and he's kind of like a shop foreman. What? You just touch poison ivy, boss. The craziest thing we have to deal with is Larry. Why are we gonna make it that big? That's what you said you wanted. I didn't say it. Well, I didn't say I wanted something clean. Let me kick this I've probably gone through like 300 tape measures since I've been working. Here's <laughs> John with your plate of mud. Here's John Ives. He's a big giant goof. He does a lot of sculpting, set design. We always leave the buses everywhere. No one can do it better than I can do it. You know that. So he does a good job in the end, but he creates disaster along the way, and that really bothers me. We gotta get this water cleaned up, and we have no idea where it's coming from. And Patty works here. Patty is my significant other. They don't want to talk to me, they want to talk to you. I'm gonna be a right now. Yeah, get over here. I got my kids working here. So it's really a family affair. Just put that over here. My son, Riley, he's like mini-me. And he's sending his agent. Because you're always trying to do things that no one has ever done, sometimes that leads to problems. Right now, we must have like 20, 30 people wanting us to build attractions for them. We built a Spider-Man dark ride. Spider-Man, you can't stop the Scorpion. <laughs> You'll never get past Dr. Octopus. <laughs> Thanks to you. We made comic books come to life. That was awesome. Welcome to the Jekyll and Hyde Club. We're at the famous Jekyll and Hyde Club in New York City, Times Square. I've never worked under these type of conditions before. It was crazy. Hi there. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy around here, let me tell you. They're in the way, cameraman. We're gonna work with gunite, which is concrete sprayed out of a gun. 
<laughs> can't manage it like that, dude. The spider that I ordered is way bigger than the space that we built for the spider. You guys see how we can fit a 13 foot spider in a. Wait a minute. It doesn't show you where the feet are. You There's said no we way don't. You can get a foot on both Did you sides. say this was. What we do is like it's everything rolled into one. We're pickers. We have to go out into antique stores and farms and flea markets. We need a lot of door headers, a lot of antique furniture, a lot of old stuff. Stuff that's been pulled out of real mansions. How much you want for this? We'll take this one. Isn't that where they uh and this white one? Like a cold door? Uh, we just got a job building a bunch of pirate ships, and I'm thinking about buying these. I want to get this one, this one. We'll take it for 50 bucks. Two thousand. Holy and I had to talk this guy out of this thing. He wanted a fortune and I ended up paying a hundred bucks for it. I also want this jet fan over here because I'm a big fan of fans. I'm a big fan of fans. I don't know if you caught that. It's like the craziest thing around here is like, you know, we could be putting a shark and type inside a shark tank. I'm here in our 40 foot diameter shark tank. To the next minute we're theming an aquarium or in a restaurant or doing something like with black light for kids. Everything we do is an American attraction.